Savetti is here, and oh my god, Diablo 4 is and being I'm taken over. Here. No, not by the necromancer minions, but by a completely different group of people. And who might that group be? Well, you're gonna see in just a moment. It's the same group from Diablo 3, same group from Diablo 4. They have been infiltrating our ranks and just pretty much taken over. What do you mean? Well, take a look at this. You ever run into a point where you just need some cash, you can't upgrade? You know, you got the materials, you've been farming out there, but you're a little bit short on gold. I got people posting, I see this on social media all the time. People are like, okay, get out there and grind. But here's the thing, do you want to grind those gears, salvage the gears and get your mats? Or do you want to get gold? How do you decide which to do? Some people are taking a different route. When they get to level 100, a lot of people there are offering their services to their friends. They're like, hey, I'm level 100 now. How about you guys come and join me? I'll go farm some dungeons. You guys just sit there at the entrance, and when it's done, come clean up all the loot. You can sell it. You can also um, salvage it as well to get the bats, right? There's a different group of evil people out there. Yeah, followers of Lilith, apparently, and they have decided that they're going to go out there and charge you money for this. Yeah, they're actually charging for this. Look at this boosting service nowadays. Yeah, isn't it illegal? They're, they're, this guy is saying here on social media, they're like, they're charging like 700, so that's like 14 USA dollars to 1K. Uh, this is Philippine currency, so that would be $20. So people charging upwards of $20 an hour for you to stand at the dungeon. They go do all the fighting and you just run through and loot. Friends will do this for free, people. Why are we paying for this? I don't know, but it, it gets even. There's even a new group of people, okay? People who just go out there like the ones we had in Diablo Immortal and Diablo 3. And they just say, hey, you want something? We'll go ahead and get it for you. Look at this leveling boost. There, there's a level 100 guy out here and he's like okay, you just join his group stand at the front of the dungeon and you just go ahead and collect your gear when it's done yeah we know that's what clans are for a lot of people don't know about that join a clan clans do this for each other now this guy here has the same thing with the sorceress he cleans the dungeons out you go ahead and collect the loot People out there, they will sell you gold, they will sell you items. Game items are tradable in Diablo 4, you guys know that. And there are services out there making a killing doing that. So I just had to open your eyes to this, people, and just let you know. It's out there. But does Blizzard agree with that? What What's Blizzard going to say about this kind of stuff? They're probably not going to agree with it. Some of these places got a website. Yeah, you can go to a website and order levels, order gold. This is great. This is just craziness. This is craziness. I actually contacted one. I talked to him. I'm like, hey, bro, tell me about your services. What's going on? He's like, okay, if you're ready, we could just hop on and you just stand there and I'm going to go ahead and get all the loot you need. Wow. That's amazing. That's not good, though. Look at Blizzard's terms of services. You can't have anyone playing your account unless it's like you or your child. But do you see the loophole they got here? They're not playing your account. You're just standing at the entrance. And they're doing all the work. And then you just pick up the items. So I don't know. How is Blizzard going to go after people who are not piloting your account? You're literally just standing at the entrance and looting. Blizzard, what do you do about that? I don't know. People, drop me a note down here. How can Blizzard even fight against that? It's like they're not even touching your PC. How do you fight against people grouping up with you illegally? I have no idea. You guys let me know in the comments. So, Fadius, signing out. Be sure to hit subscribe.